Thank you, Ray. A fire gutted a local home this morning, leaving nothing but a charred shell behind. A man who was inside couldn't get out in time and lost his life. The coroner has just identified him as 74-year-old James Indovina. Pam Serrano is live to explain how emergency crews rushed in to try to save him. Pam? Christine, a Murraysville medic and also police officer arrived at the house around 9 this morning and they knew someone was stuck inside. But when they tried to scream inside the house to help, no one responded. A devastating fire took the life of one man in Westmoreland County Thursday morning. We responded to a reported house fire uh, with possible entrapment. Firefighters say flames could be seen shooting from a house on Mamont Drive in Washington Township. At that point, we kicked it in, screamed in a couple times uh, to see if anybody would answer us back. Nobody answered. Uh, it was confirmed again that the gentleman was probably still in the residence at that time. I entered in um, through a couple of rooms and uh, found the gentleman laying on the floor. A medic and a police officer went into the home and pulled the man's body out. It makes it rough, you know. Uh, it's a difficult situation. You know, dealing with your own emotions, then you help the family through their emotions. So it's tough all the way around. The intense flames did not stop firefighters from trying to save the home. Crews made a very good attack. Um, yes. There was a whole bunch of fire like up in the ceiling. Yes, so we had to get a bunch of tools in to uh, pull okay. the ceiling down. Okay. But overall, crews did a very good job on the inside. It's pretty, pretty much a total loss, it looks like at this time. Fire investigators are still trying to determine how the fire started. Now, fire crews say despite the intensity of the flames today, they would never hesitate when it comes to saving a life. Reporting live, Pam Serrano, KDK News.